welcome back to my channel this is a new vlog i've been in here for about two days now and i haven't really like i haven't really spoken to you guys because i've really been trying to trying to settle down i think it's going to be the beginning of my summer vlog today what's happening i don't really know there's no plans let's see i think what i'm going to be doing is walking around and there might be some shopping here and there but that's about it to be honest nothing crazy is happening but yeah just wanted to check in and say hi to you guys and start this vlog off here because i haven't spoken to you guys since i got here So we found some really cute flat shoes for work and um, we've ordered it outside now but we're going to try it we want to try it on and then see if we like it and the most I can get it they look very cute I'll show you guys the shoes when they come I feel like Audi would really pull it up like really well but okay, this is so cute you like them? I think we're going to end up getting this because I feel like this is very practical and it looks very good. I feel like this would go really nice with everything. Only tried it on and she has like jeans on and it still look good with her outfit. So these are more like a work but I think they would look nice even with like casual outfits. So yeah. I think this is what we're going to set up for. There's also like a gold one over there. As you guys can see, there's a gold one over there, but we prefer the black one, so we're going to get the black one. Yep. Literally, my favorite place. and they are back home and that's because we came home early and actually this is not early this is like what 9 p.m but my mom and my sisters they're still out but we came home so that we can get ready because we meant to a friend invited us to the to a lounge um this evening this night and i told my friend i got my friend chili to Come as well so we just, we just came home since we're already done like getting the things that we need to get for today bad person <laughs> yes because she doesn't watch my vlog i yet. do though anyways yes so i did a very like weird get ready with me anyways chidi is here we we're meant to be going to this thing i like and she looks so nice oh my god Actually, guys, apart from the cardigan because she's cold i'm chidi but i really feel like underdressed but it's okay i'm I feel still like going looking cute that's not such a thing mm, it's underdressed <laughs> well <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm going to be for this thing at 10.30. I don't know why we thought that 10.30 in a Nigerian function actually meant 10.30. No. But, like, no. We're waiting because apparently we're going to have to get there for 12. Midnight. Yeah. Actually, we're going to do pre-drinks. I have the right idea to just chill.
and you're very similar to me, the way you take care of me. Yeah. Everything else is bonus. Oh. It's always gonna be them in fourth place, of course. Who else? I actually thought Sean and Matilda would have taken that first place, but anyways. But you made it here. The Uber driver that we that brought, brought us here wanted to kill us. Like this guy on literally on two occasions. Okay, maybe it was just on one occasion, but like two. But he almost killed one old woman. <laughs> it's not funny though. It's, funny. it's actually not funny because the thing that that's how you know that the, the madness is not just in Nigeria. Even though yeah. right. you know, trying yeah. to navigate here. In Calvin Garden. Sun is sunning. Have you ever tried uh, matcha? Me? Yeah. No, never. So we're about to try matcha for the first time. Yeah, I've never tried matcha. I think it's TikTok. So we're going to try matcha for the first time. So we're on our way to that famous matcha place. I got the mango passion fruit matcha and you got the blueberry matcha, matcha right? Yeah. So I'm going to do first impressions. Mmm. Mine is nice. Sorry. Yes, please. Yes, please. We're on our way home. Hi, guys. I'm back home. I had a very cute day like this day I, I actually didn't do much per se like you guys saw I went to Blank Street to get some matcha and like that was my first time trying matcha and I think for a first timer I think I picked the right thing I got a mango passion fruit which was such a good decision because i feel like if i had um picked anything else i wouldn't really be a fan my my ex first experience of matcha would be rubbish because yeah i just feel like it would be rubbish so i made a first grade choice oh i feel like i didn't speak to you guys the other day while i was getting ready per se or maybe i did but like basically me Odi, and chidi were getting ready to go out that day because we were invited to a party at a lounge LA lounge that was what we planned to do that day and the flight that he had sent to us said 12 30 i mean sorry 10 30 but obviously nigerian time so and in nigerian lounge as well so i obviously like said okay most this is most likely going to be starting at like 12 midnight i texted him and i was like oh when are you guys leaving he said we'll leave at 12 30 i was like okay fair enough we'll leave at the same time so we can all get there at the same time so tough as he came i messaged him he said oh we'll leave in an hour from now the minute he said that i was just like you guys i don't know this it just feels like this is going to be long it's definitely going to be long so i just took off my clothes and i showered and i relaxed because everybody just crashed let like, me didn't leave at like 12 30 i just knew it was going to be one of those ones this is the top i was meant to wear out on that day didn't end up wearing it out so i wore it today yeah and then also you guys on that same day can you believe that my nails that i just got done before leaving nigeria this one broke the off like it splits i think it split somewhere in the middle it was throbbing on that day but it's so much better now I remember the last time okay Jesus I remember the last time I did my makeup but yeah I mean 
I remember last time I did my makeup strictly just because I wanted to try and like, get some good pictures for Instagram and maybe make some nice reels. That is why I've done my makeup today. I wanted to film it on camera, but I feel like you guys have seen enough of me doing my makeup to be honest because it's always the same technique. Um, the same. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's always when I do my makeup, but I decide to be watery. Oh my god. I feel like my Instagram has been suffering a bit. I really want to like share some new pictures or a reel or something. So that's why I've gotten ready today. I look cute. I'm wearing this very cute dress. This very cute dress from Primark. I got this yesterday actually. She has this oil that I got yesterday. Avino Skin Relief Body Oil Spray. I always see this on um, Melissa Wardrobe Story. Obviously, never got my hands on this. But, so finally got them yesterday. And I know what the hype is about. I see what the hype is about. I can't even show you like the difference now. But you see how like my skin is really like glistening and glowing. <sighs> That's the work. Is the work of the oil and it's doing what it's supposed to be doing it's doing what it is supposed to be doing and it smells really good as well so that's a bonus i didn't get just one i got like three of them so i'm happy I might even go back and get more before i leave but it's really good it's a really good body oil it feels really sheer the glow do you see the glow let's go I tried to take pictures. I came up to take pictures. I tried to take pictures outside. It wasn't a picture of it. I didn't try that high. It wasn't a picture of it. One thing about me and other family is come out. We're gonna eat. So we saw this place called Busaba. Never heard of it. It's a Thai dining. It's a menu. And it looks interesting. So we're going to come in. Come and eat. And let's try and get some pictures here at the wall. So let's see. My problem is that this place is this food is very dry but it's okay. Let's see. Just wanted to try it out. Hey, I want to try the calamari. It is nice. This is not bad. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hi guys. I wanted to do a mini haul for you guys of the things that I've gotten so far since I've been here. I actually leave tomorrow. I'm leaving to New York tomorrow, so I just thought while I just kind of like pack and put the things that I've got away, it'll be good to do a haul, a mini haul now. So yeah, anyways, I figured that I set out to go and um, take some pictures. I don't know if my lips looks weird. Anyways, yeah, I figured I set out to go and take some pictures today and like, create some content, which I did. But you know what happens? Like in the middle of the night where like you're up late and you're going through Instagram and you're seeing all these different contents and then suddenly you have this burst of energy and this inspiration to just go out and do your own and like create content. Especially because of like I haven't really put anything. I used to like do reels all the time, mainly like makeup reels. So I haven't really like put anything on my Instagram in a while. So I just had this like you can actually just decide to like do your makeup and just let it be for you know you want to take pictures or you want to create content because that's what i used to do before like putting makeup even just to like just film or like just go and take photos and create content used to be my thing it used to be something that i was very happy to do because i just love creating content but now it just seems like it just seems so long and i just want to stop putting you know creating content off so that was the reason why i decided like today is going to be the day i'm going to get up have my shower get ready do my makeup wear a cute dress and try and take some picture um you know and a lot of things that 
usually discourage me from stuff like that from stuff like this is because i'm just like before i used to be very okay with it because i was just like ah some content days work and some content days flop but now like i'm so i'm i would say that i'm not even okay with the fact that it could flop now like i used to be very okay with it it's like okay i'm doing this like if it doesn't go well we go again tomorrow we go again another day but now like i'm very like rigid about that so it's like a big part of what discourages me from like having these content days and putting on makeup and you know just for strictly for the purpose of like filming or like you know creating content for instagram or you know for youtube or whatever is because i'm just like what if it flops and it's like i've done all this all this for nothing you know and like i feel like i need to get to a point where i'm like i'm okay with you know the my planned content flopping or it not going the way that i had planned for it to go i need to be okay with i need to get to the point where i'm okay with it again so i think yeah that's what i'm trying to do so i you know set out to do that today we went back to common garden because i feel like there are just a lot of like nice places there to take pictures even though i didn't really get any pictures outside i didn't really try honestly like we, we tried to take like one outside and i like, hated it so i was like okay actually let's just go and eat and then inside the restaurant we ate at this um thai restaurant called busaba and inside the restaurant I was just like okay let's try taking some pictures here and i did it was kind of like more of like a portrait kind of picture and i really liked it I, like this these are nice i'm very happy with these so i'm just like i just stuck with that and for, for that we came home so yeah i'm back home I'm back home and I simply just wanted to I keep adjusting the things. I don't know if it's properly placed. I'm back home. I just really wanted to give you guys like a mini haul of everything. Um, I think I'm going to not everything, but like just like a mini haul, right? Of what I've gotten so far since I've been here. Um, so I think I'm going to start with products. As usual, I had to get some reups of my La Roche Posay um sunscreen i usually get the there's one that's green and then there's one that's blue i usually get the I mean, let this thing focus first i usually get the blue one the one that says um hydrating i don't know if it's focused or if it's going to focus i think it's focused now yeah i usually get the blue one the one that says hydrating cream because i just like that hydration or anything that's going to give me hydration that's going to feel like it's moisturizing my skin i really love so instead of getting like the one i think the green one is like the oil control one so i always get the hydrating one i remember there's a vlog where i mentioned that i had gotten this um the Irish per se purifying foaming gel cleanser i mentioned that i gotten it i gotten it for the first time ever i think this was like last no this was it last year summer that was 2023 i got it for the first time and i was like oh i'm going to try this out i don't know how is that's going to be or you know how it's going to feel on my skin or if my skin is going to like it but i'm going to try it out and guys I've, I've been using it and my skin loves this thing my skin eats this up so yeah i've been using this for the past one year i had to get some more re-ups of this also i stopped by a boots and i got this larish Rose um moisturizer so the first time i'd ever used this was when i visited hello perfect and um i got my first treatment with them and they had recommended some products for me to be using and one of those products was this moisturizer from large for day so i wasn't really sure about it or did you know the first day i used it i was i fell in love you know when people say oh this is a moisturizer this is a moisturizer this is a moisturizing cream this is the definition of a moisturizing cream this is what a moisturizer should be so and then also i don't need to say much about this, this is my micellar um micellar water which i use after I cleanse my face, I use this before going in with my moisturizer and I use, also use this to take off my makeup. So this is very essential for me. So I had to re up on this. I also got this Bondi Sands um, Body SPF 50 from Superdrug. Um, I'm very generous with SPF on my face and I'm just kind of wondering why I don't use SPF on my body. So um, yeah, I also that's that's kind of weird. I should be using SPF on my body so even though I have um, a large per se SPF for my body but I'm not very consistent with it um, but anyways I had gotten this one just to like try and be on top of it and like you know caring about skin on my body as much as I care about the skin on my face because I told you guys about this um, body oil from Avino understand the hype 
I spoke about it briefly already earlier, so just know that this is actually this is a tent and body oil. It is so cute. Really, I really feel like we always end up finding some really cute gems at dunes. That's why the things are like sometimes they hit or miss because you might not always find what you're looking for. You might always find cute, nice things in June, but like crazy things. I remember I'm in London, I always want to check dunes, you know, because you never know what you'll find. They have some really cute stuff, in my opinion. In my opinion, sometimes because it could be a hit, it could be a miss. Um, so we got this for like work or like casual i to be fair i shouldn't even say because it, it can be worn you know on a casual day out whatever but like, i really feel like i'd mainly be wearing this for um work but it is so classy it, like it actually reminds me of the chanel one so when we saw we tried it on you guys saw that earlier so everything looks it has a little a very very tiny small heel i guess and then this shiny part is it looks so good like it's actually my face you would think that the shinier one the shiny one with all the spark sparkly bits is my fave but this is actually my fave like it was a good buy and i know that i will get a lot of wear out of it like i'm so sure that i'll get a lot of wear out of it i stopped by at urban outfitters and guess what I saw? This Stanley cup and it's black as well. So I feel like it will go with everything. And I'm not going to go crazy and try and get like multiple colors. I feel like this is the only one. And maybe one other one. I might get like another like neutral color. It's safe to say that I've joined the Stanley WhatsApp group. I got this in black, white, and gray. Um, I think I already wore the gray one out. And I got these pants in black and blue like you guys this is so me like it's giving like you know office straight leg pants that's what it's giving but like you can also wear this out casually like pair this with a nice top and wear this out and i will also wear this to work as well so like i got this in this is like a navy a deep blue color navy blue color navy blue color and i got this in black as well i already wore the black one and then it has these and then also this white things in front which i thought was very it was very like edgy very cool detail for these um trousers got this black um camisole i got another um basic white tank top i guess i don't feel like i can wear and pair these basics with anything and everything and i don't have to struggle with like dressing up i wear linen with anything and it always looks really good so like that's why i kind of got into and i didn't really like wearing my jeans anymore i was always looking for my linen trousers i wanted to get more linen trousers so i got this from zara i got this in gray i got this i would say this is green but like i don't know what color i think it's like a i don't know it doesn't come off as green on camera but like this is actually green it looks like a deep gray also got it in black because it just makes sense to have it in black i got this um vest like um top i got this in like what i got this in like two other colors which unfortunately this is not a try on haul guys i wish it was but it's not <laughs> You have to see when I wear it. This top, this is my fave ever. This white blouse is the cutest thing ever. When I when I tried it on, it was, looks so good. So I got this. I told you guys I got that blue one in like two other different colors. I think I got this is this is it. This is in white. This is it in green. This is the best thing in green. And I also got like it's similar but different this is kind of like a vest kind of thing this one i feel like i can definitely that other one i don't think i can wear it to work but this one i feel like i definitely wear this to work and the fitting is really good i got this in like two other colors as well got this in burgundy i can wear it casually i can wear it to work i just got it in two colors actually i didn't get it in the um dark blue and then i got this really cute black dress from zara just sitting when i tried it on chef's kiss 
I got this black dress in what size small. I wanted to get an, an extra small just so that like it can feel like extra tight on my body. And also because like it's kind of like a stretchy material, so I know that like it wouldn't be something that doesn't fit me because I've gotten an extra small. You know, some materials you get them in extra small for my body, and they won't fit. Like I literally like shot myself on the foot by myself when i do that but like this one i just knew it was going to fit i tried it on anyways but i got this in a small same dress in like this blue color i don't know exactly what this blue color is but like guys i had to get it in a different color and i got this one in an extra small and fitting for both the small and the extra small is just perfect like it was just perfect so i was just like yes so I was pretty much very happy with everything. I was going to give you guys a mini haul of what I've gotten so far since I've been in London. I actually leave for New York tomorrow. So um, I think I'm about to just pack up my stuff. Because I think I'm going to leave my stuff here. Because obviously I'm still coming back here before going back to Nigeria. So I'm going to leave a lot of stuff here. So like there isn't like excess luggage. And I think I'll most likely be ending this vlog here. I'm trying to like a bit and get this vlog up tomorrow by God's grace. So let's see. I'm challenging myself. I won't challenge myself to actually do that. So let's see what happens. Anyways, bye guys.